Today, today, today's session is to explain the and sketch the structure of electrical drawing using AutoCAD. Okay? So, electrical drawings is our today's agenda, and uh, and the objective is we will we will draw the single line diagram SLD, single line diagram of electrical system using AutoCAD. So electrical drying, what is electrical drying? You can see the definition here. Electrical drying is a type of technical drying that shows information about power, lighting, and communication for the engine. And electrical working drying consists of lines, symbols, dimensions, notations, etc. A one line diagram or single line diagram is the diagram that uses single lines and graphics. You will see here that uh, here is the single line diagram. You can see only lines, single lines. If it is three phase system, we will just mention only single line because three phase identical system is there. So it means we will only mention one line and we will assume that all other are symmetrical. So we will mention three lines, three uh, uh, cross section lines here on this single line and that will show that it this line is actually three lines like that. So single lines and then graphic symbols. So you can see here the transformer, just the graphic symbol, then is the load. Uh, you can see the breakers. So breaker is just like that and switches. So you can see everything is in symbols. So now this is also the single line diagram. You can draw this one as well. Distribution panel. This is distribution panel. Today we'll draw single line diagram of 11 kV substation. 11 kV substation. This diagram will draw, okay? This one. So you can see here that uh, from 11 kV, 11 kV line. Tell me the lagri. How do you lagri? Okay, yes, it's right. Rosa, 11 kV line and then there is a gang operated switch. Then there is a cable box, then underground cable, for example. Then there is a 11 kV oil circuit breaker, oil circuit. There are different types of breakers. We also mentioned in workshop lab, but uh, air circuit breaker, vacuum circuit breaker, oil circuit breaker. Uh, Gas, SF6 gas circuit breakers, and uh, like that. So, and the applications are different depending on the rating of the voltage. So, here 11 kV, so oil circuit breaker is used. Then there is a current transformer. So, here is the current transformer CT, CT, and PT. PT means potential transformer and CT current transformer. So, CT is ratio is 50 ratio 5. 50 ratio 5 means uh, if 50 ampere current will flow through this line you will get 5 ampere. So the multiplier is 10 in this case. And CT here is 200 ratio 5 mean the multiplier is 40. So because the meters, meters you can you can say that uh, uh, our meters, multimeters are something like the uh, measuring meters, display meters who display the current like that. So you can see they cannot, they have the limited range. They cannot uh, measure, for example, 200 ampere, not possible. And uh, 550 ampere, not possible. So we need the cities. So cities just 50 ratio 5 mean if 50 ampere, 5 ampere. If uh, the meter will show uh, 1 ampere, it means actually 10 amperes are flowing th through the circuit. So 10 amperes are scaled to, to 1 ampere. Similarly, 200 slash 5, if 200 ampere, amperes will flow, it means we will see in the display 5 ampere means 200 amperes are flowing and here is the ct you can see 1200 slash 5 so the uh, multiplier is very good 240 240 is the multiplier here and like that so these are the cities and then it, there is a transformer 1 mva the apparent power so transformer is Parent power S, that is the combination of P plus JQ, active and reactive power. 
So you can see at one MV mega volt ampere. One mega volt ampere, or you can say thousand kilo volt ampere KVA, thousand KVA. Transformer is there, and this transformer is stepping down voltage because uh, until here the uh, primary uh, until here you can see eleven KV line is there. You can see this section is eleven KV section. And after transformer, you can see it is stepped down to 400 volt. So 11 KV to 400 volt because in our uh, streets, you can see uh, near our house, in front of our house or near our houses in our colonies, you can see here that uh, transformers are there. So those transformers actually 11 KV to 400 volt. So this 400 volt now we can use it at our homes. For our U Tesla, you can see 11 KV feeder, Margala feeder, 11 KV feeder, dedicated feeder that is dedicated. Uh, no colony is invi uh, involved here. Only uh, uh, that 11 kV feeder is only for you, Tesla. So that 11 kV feeder is coming from uh, Margala uh, uh, substation. You can see, uh, and here you can see uh, near our electrical department. You can see in the corner near uh, cafe. Cafe, which name of cafe? G C cafe. Near the G C cafe, you can see. There is a uh, 11 kV feeder and then there is a transformer. You will also see the transformer there. So. Uh, then we use uh, that is the main source. You can see if we want to switch off all the electricity from in UTEX, we will switch there from there. OK, there we also have the gang on uh, gang operators with geo switch there. OK, so switch over from Bobda to generator. These days we are not operating generator because the diesel very price very high and we don't need actually maybe because uh, our labs are OK. Electricity is there. Popda is providing uh, electricity till 3.30. After that, load shedding started here in Utex. So we no, don't need, I think so. So but for Kaluni, those who are uh, living in Kaluni, so they also uh, uh, start. Uh, we have the backup generator, diesel generators. Two diesel generators are there. 256 kilowatt, one generator and two is 256 multiplied by two. So here we can see the gang operated switch just to switch over. If Vabda is there is OK. If Vabda not there, so we'll have the gang over switch. We'll change it and then we'll start the generator. Similar case uh, we do in our, at our homes. Then uh, you can see here. Uh, 400 volt and then there again main. Main oil circuit breaker and then there is a CT and then is the 400 volt bus bar. 400 volt bus bar. This one is 11 kV bus bar and this one is 400 volt bus bar. Bus bar is just you can see the bar where from where you have the multiple connections out or in like that. So this is the simple you can say very simple uh, diagram we will draw today. OK, last time we have drawn uh, for example, we have drawn. Uh, we have drawn this one. This was uh, actually single line diagram of 33 slash 11 kV substation. That was a little complex. So then uh, we also drawn a single line diagram of uh, our house house wiring. So this was also very complex, I think so. But today is very simple. We will finish it soon. OK. So let's start. So we'll uh, we'll uh, do this in layers because layers we already learned. So will everything onward. We'll do in layers. So every time create the layers. So, uh, so text layer because we have the text, then symbols, symbol layer, all the symbols of the components, and then uh, text, symbol, and lines. Three layers, huh? Three layers we need. And then maybe bus bars, we will, we will, this bus bar and this bus bar, it should be a little, you can, the line should be thick. So, bus bar layer, we will have separate layer, okay? Just uh, to increase the thickness of these two lines. And everything in between lines, you can see we can draw with the simple lines there. So let's start. So we'll first draw the this line, OK? So. So O snap must be on. O snap must be on and ortho must be on, OK? Ortho is on. O snap should be on, OK? This is actually O snap where you, uh, if O snap is not on, you just uh, uh, activate it and also select it all. Select all means the end points, midpoint, center, everything will be, it will be helping during our 
trying, okay? So now first we'll create the layers. Layer properties, create first layer. First layer, for example, I will say bus bars, bus bars, bus bars. I want to create separate layer. Then there are lines, lines, lines layer. Then the next layer is, for example, symbols, 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 symbols layer. And then the last layer is text layer, text, text layer. Okay, text. So these four layers we need. And bus bar, just click here and uh, click here and color it, color it. For example, I will say bus bar is my bus bar is my bus bar is yellow because black window, black window, uh, dark color not visible. So we will have the light color, for example, yellow. Lines layer, for example, green. Symbols, for example, cyan, cyan. And then text layer, text layer, for example, For example, orange, orange may be visible, more visible. Orange, okay, so it's done. Now activate the layer bus bar, bus bar layer. Every time activate the layer first and then start working within that layer. So bus bar and then click the lines and draw one line. For example, this line is. For example, the length of the line is 100, for example. 100 units I want to take the line. 100 units now the, this x y coordinate if you want to move it towards uh, left bottom corner so go to view and uh, view display icons origin so now it is just 100 units i have drawn the line 100 units and then i can zoom it and zoom it just to it depends on your uh, situation what, what's the requirement but just now it is random okay 100 units for example 100 units If 100 units length is screen display, so you can use the zoom option. OK, if your mouse uh, zoom not working, so you have the option alternate option there. Just go to tools and. I think so. I didn't show you this file which wa I was explaining. So you can see this was actually the file where I was explaining everything circuit breaker, transformer, and everything. And sometimes, which I also face this problem, and maybe you will also face during the AutoCAD. Sometimes, when you start the AutoCAD, sometimes when you start the AutoCAD, Sometimes you, when you start the AutoCAD, you will see that uh, AutoCAD is asking, asking uh, license sometimes. So don't need to uninstall and install. This is a very hectic process and just wastage of time. Okay. So another alternative, which yes, recently Howard told me, and you can see here that uh, uh, just click. There are two options: enter the license key, or it will say server license address. The first option, first option. When you will open the AutoCAD, AutoCAD will not open. Just it will ask. Just you need the license. 
So the first option will be server address. The same is just click next and just enter this 127.0.0.1 and click OK. So this is the server address and now it will be activated. So no need to uninstall and something like that. Every time you will uninstall, install, this is a very, so this is the solution, okay? So now this line and uh, <clears throat> if you want to increase the thickness, just to go to properties and then there's a lines weight. This is line weight. If I will increase the line weight, just increase the line weight, you will see that uh, line weight is not increased. So you will have to switch on or activate LW. Which option? LW? LWT option you will activate. So you see now, no, it is bold. So right click, go to properties, and then the line weight and line weight just increase. The line weight, any weight you can increase depending on your situation. Increase the weight and then switch on line weight, LWT, or just for the newer versions, just here, L, LW display. So now this line has drawn in the layer of bus bars. Now I will. I will. Lines layer now activate the line layers. Now I want to start work working in. Within the layer of lines, so now. For example. You can see here that uh, I will. Draw the line. So this line I will draw. So go to line command. And just in the center, if O snap is on, you see the midpoint is shown. So just click here and draw the line. For example, I will draw this line. For example, 20, 20 minutes line, OK? And enter. So you see, line is drawn. Line is drawn. Now I need this circle. You see here. Need a gang operated switch. Geo switch, geo switch that is gang operated switch. And that is uh, you can see here that. Uh, two circles and then one line. OK, so this we will draw. So first we'll draw the circle and circle just depending on the just. Go to circle and just draw circle. Circle should be just zoom it, zoom it. Just you can see here, just zoom it. And circle should be a. Like for example, we need uh, this circle is enough. This circle is enough. Or you can specify the radius. So for example, two radius, two radius. And I will press enter. Radius is two. Now you can move this circle. You can move the circle click here and just because uh, the line is. At the center of the circle, so you, we don't want because. Uh, here you can see the. Circle is the, the circle. St the start point of the circle is the end point of the line, so you can see here. I want to move the circle, so modify move. And end point of the circle, take this end point and just move it towards end of the line. So here you can see no adjusted. Now for example again this same circle I need so I will copy it, modify, copy. This circle a little bit uh, for example distance. I need the distance for example. Maybe eight is enough. I will press eight and press enter. OK, so you see the circle is placed at a distance of. Eight units. From the first circle, OK? Now I need the line single line, so I will click the line and. Uh, you can see here the line. 
from this point. So ortho must be off because no ortho will create, create the problem. So you just like in this way towards center, just O snap, take the help of o, with O snap. You see this is drawn. So symbol switch. You can see we have drawn. A little bit a distance will be more so uh, I will delete it and again for example. I think so now is okay. This switch now the cable box again line and then there's a cable box cable box is just a rectangle. So I will draw another line for example from here. Ortho must be on now, OK? So another line, for example, 10 units, 10 units line, OK? So now, now I need cable box. Cable box is just a rectangle. So rectangle, if I want to draw, I can draw with the help of lines. Or polygon also possible, maybe. And polygon with three sides, with three sides. Specify center point, for example, I will take center this. Now it will say inscribed circle. OK, enter. You see polygon. Now uh, specify the radius. For example, I will say. The radius is. Uh, maybe six is enough, six is enough. Now you can see this. Uh, Inverted, so mean I have to rotate it, rotate our mirror image. Mirror image also take. Okay, for example, this rectangle the same as this one. So I need the mirror of this one. So modify, and I will take the mirror, and go to mirror, and I will just uh, mirror it. Okay, press center. So mirror it. G. Yes, triangle you have oh, just with the help of polygon. Polygon with three sides mean triangle. Or with the help of lines, just lines if I will draw just with the help of lines, I will draw one line. Ortho should be on. For example, uh, this uh, this length is for example 10. And then I need uh, ortho should be off. And you can see here the center point and center from the center point. You can see. You can see here that for example. Seven units is OK. Seven may be less huh? the same length we want. So this one 10, so I will. Specify this one how much. Maybe this was a. Uh, 10 here, yeah, 10. So with the help of lines, ortho should be off. So same. Keeping the center, this one and uh, 10 units. OK, 10 units. 10 units, OK. Now I will mirror it, mirror it. For example, mirror, select this one and uh, Mirror it. You can also draw with the help of lines. You can draw or with the polygon. Again, I will repeat polygon. Yes, you see the sides of the enter the sides of polygon. That is three, three plus and enter right three and plus center. Then specify the center of polygon. So wherever you want to place, this is the center. No inscribed or uh, circumscribed. Inscribed mean within the circle. So is okay. This is I is okay. By default, press enter. Now you see it will say ortho should be off, uh, on, should be on so that you can only place like that. So now for the radius, for example, seven radius, press enter. So it will be placed. Okay, this is done now. So we'll. Now, for example, I. I want to move this rectangle, modify, move. Move this 
here and now I want to move this. Move from here to here. Just. Connect the end points of line and triangle, so this is done now. There is an underground cable. Underground cable is the hidden line, okay? Because it's not visible. So we also need the layer of hidden lines. So hidden line layers, I will create the another line layer, hidden, hidden, hidden layer, okay? Hidden lines, hidden lines. So I will color it, for example, color it light, light blue. So hidden line, I need the hidden line for I will click the layer hidden layer. And then I again. Create the line. Yeah, yeah, no hidden layer. You can see here in the hidden layer. You will also uh, change the line type. Click here load lines and click here. For example, hidden. H hidden. This is hidden hidden layer. Click OK. So click the hidden layer. OK. So now let's uh, now let's line command and, and you can see here now is the hidden layer. Okay, so for example, 10 units, 10 units press enter. So this is the hidden layer, but you can see here if you, if you will zoom it, it is the hidden layer. But if you see now this because I have taken 100 unit length, you can see this this bus bar is 100 units. So you can see. That, that is the reason if you will take the length, for example, 10 units or 15 units, this hidden line will be visible. But there is another solution. Other solution is just change the hidden layer to just change the line type, load it and the this ISO dash space. The, the single single line, OK, single line type ISO dash space. Maybe this is visible. Maybe this is visible. Let's try. Let's try. No, uh, just change another line, for example, ISO dash. ISO dash. Yeah, no, we have to select this first. Select this line first and just change the line type from here. Yeah, this one. Just try another line type. For example, कोई और line type try करें जिससे ये visible हो जाए. वैसे तो visible थी लेकिन वो zoom करना पड़ रहा था. So just uh, try by your own any other line type and tell me if you have if you are successful. So here, if the hidden line is there, you see this is hidden line, but uh, you can see here if I will draw like this hidden line. So I have to increase the length of this hidden line. Maybe that then will be visible. Huh? For example, I will draw this hidden line. No is OK. You see, no is OK hidden line. Then again, this this rectangle, this rectangle. I will move this rectangle. At the end point of the hidden line, so this is done. Now I need uh, again one line and then 11 KB oil circuit breaker. OK, the line is for example, line is. Again, the same line if you need, you can copy it also. Like this. And line just uh, activate the respective layer. That is lines layer. And then there is a oil circuit breaker. Oil circuit breaker is just the circle. Two circles, small circle, one outer circle, then there's a line. So, and all these things you can see, all these things are available in AutoCAD. Here, here you can see if you will install AutoCAD electrical, AutoCAD electrical. I, I didn't install AutoCAD electrical, I just AutoCAD simple. If you will install, get into PC and you will install, for example, AutoCAD electrical. You see, uh, this is AutoCAD A. You can see here is the A. And in the Subscript A in, into E. You see here E means electrical. So if you will install AutoCAD electrical, 
So then these symbols, no need to draw these symbols. These symbols are available there. Like before we have, uh, I think so, control to control to. You can see this is the window and uh, you can see. Uh, uh, home and uh, ENUS design center and these are the symbols available for example house designer blocks you can see bathtub is available chimney available door is available fancy uh, toilet staircase spiral sink pedestal sink oval garage door and uh, window and this window half circle bathroom like that door so these are the available and if I, I will click, for example, again, house space planner, space planner blocks. You see bed is available, chair, desk available, chair, lamp is available, table, wet bar, phone desk, piano, baby grand, desk, copy, dining, table, rectangular, sofa, sofa, round back, plant. So these are the things available here also. But it is not electrical, so all dedicated electrical things are not available in this uh, version. So AutoCAD electrical is only dedicated for these things. But I think so this is more good you can draw by your own. So if you are only working in AutoCAD electrical, speci especially for that, so you can install AutoCAD electrical as well. You get it? No, no, we don't have any other things. We don't have to learn anything. We don't have to draw anything. We don't have to use anything. We don't have to use anything. वो तो कोई इशू नहीं है तो इधर ड्रा करनी पड़ रही है तो ये ज्यादा मुश्किल हो गया ना उसके बाद आप वो कर लें उसमें भी कोई इशू नहीं है तो सेम इंटरफेस इज सेम यू कैन इंस्टॉल दैट वन इलेक्ट्रिकल पावर यू कैन सी इलेक्ट्रिकल पावर इज आल्सो देयर अलार्म ब्रेकर ब्रेकर यू कैन सी दीस थिंग्स आर अवेलेबल फ्यूज इज अवेलेबल यू कैन सी ट्रांसफार्मर इज अवेलेबल दिस ट्रांसफार्मर एडजस्टेबल दिस इज ऑटो ऑटो ट्रांसफार्मर दिस डेल्टा ट्रांसफार्मर ट्रांसफार्मर थ्री फेज जनरेटर so small few things are available you can see but uh, not all electrical power then there is a cmos integrator cmos cmos available and then basic electronics basic electronics you see battery capacitor circuit breaker diode zener full bridge fuse generator ground resistor operational amp motor lamp lamp Transformer. This transformer we also need today, so I will drag it here. I will drag it here. You see, this is the transformer we also need. We will also draw by our, by our own, but this transformer we. AutoCAD textile and line dive. You can see. This we have to install the plugin maybe. Hydro HO HVAC. Landscaping, stepping stone, trees, you can see tree, hot top, lamp outdoor. So these are the things available. Pipe fitting, plant process, welding, welding, fastener metric, kitchen, kitchen also available. Kitchen, you can see base cabinet, base cabinet, one door, dishwasher. And uh, ice and water, kitchen, sink, refrigerator, refrigerator, two door, refrigerator. Use anything, just drag it on the window and it will be here. Okay, let's. Uh, So uh, you can also see the today's labs tasks are task one is you can see you will do at your home homework. This is homework. You will find the single line diagram of electrical system. If your relative is working in any electrical, for example, discos, ISCO, PESCO, ESCO, GESCO, GESCO, the name of LESCO, MES, MEPCO, or Consi, ISCO, ESRI. अगर इधर काम कर रहे हैं या कोई एनपीसीसी, एनटीडीसी, वेर एवर रिलेटेड टू वापदार समथिंग लाइक दैट, तो जस्ट आस्क देम टू प्रोवाइड यू एसएलडी सिंगल लाइन डायग्राम ऑफ रियल पाकिस्तानी सिस्टम, बिकॉज़ दिस दिस सिंगल लाइन डायग्राम इज़ ओनली एनी अदर सिस्टम फ्रॉम फॉर एनी अदर कंट्री मेंबी, सो 
if you want to use the real SLD of our Pakistan system, just if your relative is there, so just from from them and just draw this. This is task one. So if you no relative there, so you you will follow this one. Find the SLD of practical system from freelancing websites. Okay, so uh, freelancing websites, for example, Fiverr. Fiverr, you will search just just search single line diagram of electrical system. Okay, <coughs> a single line diagram of single line diagram of electrical system. Okay, so you will say <coughs> single line diagram. You will search it. AutoCAD also. So here you can see there are single line diagrams. For example, this one. You can just click it here. And just click it here. So one one student can draw this one, for example. This one, OK. Just save it. <laughs> if you want to save this, you see this is the WEPV file. So you can copy it. Just copy it and paint paint 3D. Paint 3D a little bit more. You can see paint 3D. Just new and just paste it here. So you see something resolution is better. Now you can control save, control S. Okay. So in this way you can control SLD3 for example. So you can save it. You can draw like that. Okay. This single line diagram also may be not visible, so no need. So this is the proper pattern to, to provide the single line diagram to the client. So this single line diagram also there. So any other. This one you can draw this one like that. OK, so this one also available. This one. So everyone will have a different single line diagram SLD. OK, so just take from freelancing website. Because these are the real diagrams you can see here. Which clients need so this is the need of the day so. Yes, this one you can see. So these type of single line diagram just make it simple. If it is complex, just avoid it. If you can draw it is, it's OK, but you can draw search it and just draw as simple as possible just to learn it. So the task two is construct the single line diagram of your house wiring. OK, <clears throat> so house wiring your house wiring. OK, so one example is just I also draw house wiring this one. So just follow this these steps and just Rooms, you can say this uh, bedroom. This is a drawing room, bedroom, two kitchen, mushroom, bathroom, like that. So these are the rooms and these are the breakers. So you will take this example and you will draw single line diagram of your house. Okay. And similarly, third one, third task is construct the single line diagram of electrical engineering department. Electrical engineering. So um, our electrical, for example, this is the switchboard. So what is the next consecutive source? If uh, I want to uh, cut off the supply to this switchboard, where is the next uh, previous? Uh, you can say uh, DB, our uh, distribution box, and then from where this electricity steps? You can say this distribution box. You can see this is only for ACs and uh, and uh, computers. This one, but this switchboard for fans and lights. Okay, so what is the uh, previous source? One next source because you can see here in the gallery there are some distribution boxes are there, breakers are there, so these are connected with them, and then they, those are connected at the entrance. You can see there is the entrance electrical department. There is a big one, 
not in the uh, it is the first floor i think so in the first floor you have the main distribution box and then main distribution box now it is connected to the that main source 11 kv system you can see like that through transformers and lines so for this uh, electrical engineering department single line diagram you can connect uh, you can contact uh, tarik tanoli you know the tarik tanoli tarik tanoli sir you can search or you can find a uh, chairman of just ask him tarik tanoli and mumtaz mumtaz sir tarik tanoli sir and uh, this is the, this is our team about electrical in department so they know everything about breakers because they used to repair these th things and you can see everything faults are there they, they are they are they are they used to address these faults okay so they know everything so they can help you where this main uh, you can this uh, this supply is the laboratory side uh, this lab supply and where is the main source if i want to cut off all supply of this lab so from where i can cut off outside this lab for example emergency is there for example safety for the safety emergency is there so just uh, I want to cut off the supply from the outside. So where is that source? So that you you can say if you know everything, then after knowing everything, then you can draw the single line diagram of our electrical engineering department. So in this way you can draw. So the next one is oil circuit. This circle we want to draw. First small circle and then this one so <clears throat> again the same circle i need so i will copy it just copy it it here so you can see here these are the symbols these switches symbols so I have to because I have mistakenly placed this symbol in the lines layer. So I have to shift it into symbols layer. So I will convert it into symbols layer. OK. Similarly, this box is symbol, so I will convert it into symbols. So this is a symbol. Similarly. This one also I will click it and I will set the symbol layer. So it is shifted to symbols layer. Also one thing more which we have mistakenly not doing so control s every time save it first okay otherwise load setting pc off everything off efforts gone so control s so first in the start you have to redrive labs ed lab and you can see six sld okay sld 11 kb 11 kb station now every time control s control s okay so this is done now another circle so for that again i will copy it modify copy and i will copy this towards for example here is enough or are you or you can for example you can enter 10 unit for example 10 unit and press enter okay so like that now i want to draw the circle circle so circle should be the midpoint so circle and i will have the midpoint of these lines so i will temporarily temporarily i will draw one line for example this line and i will draw the circle at the mid of this line okay so that you can see is okay this is enough so this radius is 10 for example 10 unit radius so this is drawn now this line i also need this line the circuit breaker is something like that so you can see we need this line so i will shift this line i don't want to delete this because i also need this line so why not to shift it here just shift it here so it's okay so our oil circuit breaker is ready so again we have we have uh, placed this uh, <coughs> symbol in lines layer, so I have to shift it into symbols layer. So it is done. Now I will draw another line, so I will copy it. For example, I can copy also. I can copy this and I will place it here. It is okay. 
So oil circuit breaker is ready. No CT. No, I want to draw the CT. CT. So there are different symbols of cities. You can draw this city or another city. For example, I want to draw the city. So I will take the ellipse. Ellipse center ellipse I will take, for example, and I will just uh, <coughs> I will just draw this line. <coughs> ellipse of three units, for example. This one is the ellipse. <coughs> and I also need another ellipse, so I will copy it. And I will move it here. And also, I will extend this line because I need this to extend this line. So I will extend it, for example, 15 units. Now, this is the city. So I will just delete. I will use the trim command and I will do the right side. For example, trim command. Right click and just trim this one. So this is the city and I will just uh, draw another line from here. Horizontal line that is, for example, Seven units may be enough. Same line I will copy. I will copy from here to here. So city is ready. City something like that is ready. If you want to exactly copy that city is that also OK. Otherwise this city is also the symbol of the city. OK. If you want to draw that city also <coughs> possible. <coughs> For example. For example, this one. Then I will copy this. Here. <coughs> and I will use the trim command, for example. Line command 10 units, for example, and same line command. Now I will use the trim command, for example. I need this line. I don't need this line, huh? and I need this one, and I don't need this one. So this is done. So in this way, you can also draw the city like that. So I have drawn in this way, OK? So city is ready and the end is also circles. And I will just uh, take this circle. And city, you can see this city is actually. Symbol layer, OK? Symbol. Just modify, copy, and copy it, and then just uh, place it here. Ortho must be off. Ortho should be off if, if it's creating problem. You can off. Circle, modify, copy. Base point is this one, and I will place it here and here. You can see these are actually in the layer of symbols. So I will convert it into here. Now, after this, next we need a transformer. So we also have the transformer in this symbol. You can see here this transformer. You, you can 
you can move it you can move it here if you want to change the size of this transformer for example so maybe i have the option here So you can scale it, for example, scale it, for example, 10 times, 10 times. Yeah. Zoom. Yeah, it is placed here now. You can place it here. Now you can see it is scaled 10 times. So now is it more feasible? So this transformer you can use. You can rotate it. For example, you can rotate it. Just rotate it. Just like that. You can rotate it and you can use it. For example, ortho can be off and you can use it like that. Also, you can shift it to symbols layer. But maybe color you have to change it by yourself. Color. Symbols layer, but uh, you have to change the color. And another way, this is the symbol you can use it. Yes, you can use it. Now I will draw this transform myself. Okay. So how to draw this? This. So we'll draw with the help of uh, with the help of arc. For example, start center end. This arc I will use. First, I will extend this line. I will extend this line, for example, 15 units. I will again extend it. Now I will place the transformer here. Okay. So I will use the arc start center end and I will end point of this line. This start point. This is the center point. For example, center point is for example, for example, seven units, maybe seven units in enough, eight units, okay. And then again, you can see the end point. So end point is this one. So this arc is drawn. Now I want, I want many arcs. You can see these types of arcs. So what I will do, I will do, uh, I will use the array command. Array, you can see in the modify, there is an array command and rectangular array. You see multiple are run, but I need, for example, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. For example, eight. I need it. And also I need only one row, not three rows. So I will change in the row is one. Row is one. You see, so columns are nine. Columns are nine. So you see, columns are nine. Now I want to overlap it. Overlap. For overlapping, what I will do, I will just move this arrow. This arrow, I will move it like this. You see, in this way, you can overlap it. Overlap के लिए आपने करनी है. 
ओवरलैप के लिए कमांड नहीं है ये देखो एरो ऐसे मूव कर रहा हूँ ये देखना एरो से आप देखें इसको क्लिक करें ये आगे पीछे इस तरह मूव कर लें ये देखें एक एरो ये वाला है इस एरो से इसके नंबर बढ़ेंगे ये देखें नंबर ऑफ आइटम्स यू कैन इंक्रीज नंबर ऑफ कॉलम्स एक्चुअली जीज and this arrow which is the arrow between these symbols this arrow is just overlapping the distance between these otherwise you can also change the distance from here this here is a, this is the unit 10 10 distance and i will ask 5 you see 5 then 10 again i will write 10 you see now 10 i have 15 15 press enter like this 20 press enter enter like this so i need uh, 10 not 10 maybe maybe 5 no no 15 no maybe 12 yeah 12 is okay no you can see we also have to connect this so how to connect this with the help of r you can connect it or with the help of circle for example i will draw the circle and i will take the center point for example i will draw a simple line first for example here is the line now i will draw the circle as the mid point of this line is the center and i will draw the circle like uh, you can see by adjusting the just connect the lines first end points for example this is the center point so i think so now is okay now i will use the trim command right click and just trim this one see now is okay so now now just copy paste uh, just copy it modify copy this is the base point and place everywhere like this here here so in this way our transformer ready one is ready now we'll play there so we'll select this one select the whole one and just move it 1234567789 so it means 1234561234 1234. this one is the midpoint so i will copy move it move it 1 2 3 4 5 at the end of this line so now is ready transformer is ready okay so transformer is ready now i will i only need to copy this okay select this transformer uh, primary winding modify mirror it mirror it just mirror it first we also need the line for example we also need the line between the transformer you see that is line is actually the core core transformer primary and secondary winding as are not electrically connected they are magnetically connected huh? that magnetic field is the core upon which we bound the winding so this these two lines is actually the core one line or two lines okay so if two lines draw this line from here to ortho must be on okay Maybe 
place the transformer. Now select this transformer and move it towards symbol layer because this is actually the symbol. So move it to symbols. अच्छा रे का कलर फॉर चेंज किया आपने रे से बनाया आपने रे से बनाया आपने ट्रांसफार्मर रे की कमांड से यूज की क्या किया आपने ब्लॉक का कलर चेंज किया है अरे से बनाए तो रे का कलर चेंज करके दिखाएं जरा रे का रे का लेयर्स में नहीं चेंज होता देखे ना लेयर्स के अंदर लेयर्स मैंने सेलेक्ट भी की तो वो हां और उसका क्या हाल है जरा देख के एनीवन एनीवन इफ हैव दिस सॉल्यूशन जस्ट शेयर इट के लेयर्स का कलर चेंज करना है तो वो कैसे करेंगे इसकी राइट के प्रॉपर्टीज में जाऊं प्रॉपर्टीज में जाके मैं क्या करूं किधर जाऊं वहां कौन सा ऑप्शन नाम क्या है उसका ऑप्शन का ले ये कलर तो आप उसमें तो नहीं हो रहा ये प्रॉपर्टीज में रेस का कलर कैसे चेंज होगा बाकी तो हो जाता है रे का कलर चेंज हुआ आपका रे का रे का करें ना अच्छा बिकॉज अच्छा इसका हाल ये था कि हम रे बनाते ही पहले दिस सॉल्यूशन वाज जस्ट first activate the layer and then draw these lines then actually definitely that color will be the cyan color because now the color is green it means we have activated the layer of lines so the color is green so you have to repeat this process again so this is a hectic process for example i will just again repeat just to show you that for example arc start center i will activate the layer of uh, for example symbols symbols layer first now just go to arc start center and you see ortho should be on you can see for example so start center and for example here this one for example now you can see now the array is in the color which is which is assigned for the symbol layers so symbol so you can see the color is this so the solution was just to draw this array that layer and then draw this layer then you can change the color this was the solution now we have mistakenly done this so we cannot change the color no transformer after transformer there is the main ocp again the, the same circuit uh, you can say this this oil circuit breaker you will select this one we will copy this one okay no need to repeat this process we will just copy this modify copy and i will this is the base point and i will place this here so this is done okay then there is a ct so ct is also the same you can see here kaise banaya hai
Very good. So this is the solution. Another solution Howard told this. But pencil is page page. Page pencil hai. और पीछे से ना पेज होगा जरा उधर पेज ना कॉपी का एक एक कॉपी का फाड़ ले अंदर से अंदर से सो देखिए इसका अल्टरनेट सॉल्यूशन ये है कलर अगर चेंज नहीं हो रहा अभी नहीं चेंज हो रहा ना हमने ड्रा कर ली मिस्टेकली हाउ टू हाउ टू चेंज द कलर सो जस्ट सेलेक्ट दिस वन हियर इज द राइट क्लिक सेलेक्ट बोथ राइट क्लिक राइट क्लिक एंड देयर इज अ कैसे आया था आपका एडिटर किस आया था मैंने राइट क्लिक किया हां यस इसमें वो ब्लॉक वाला था ये ना वो ब्लॉक वाला था मैंने जो किया था ना क्योंकि ब्लॉक का भी कलर फिक्स हो जाता है ना अच्छा और उसका जितनी आस मतलब लेयर भी चेंज कर लें फिर भी चेंज नहीं होता अच्छा वो उसकी डिफॉल्ट सेटिंग होता है अगर ब्लॉक करना है ना इस तरह नहीं बनाना ब्लॉक से बनाना है जल्दी में फिर उसकी इधर से ब्लॉक का डिफॉल्ट ऑप्शन आएगा हम्म वहां से बॉक्स से कैसे बनाया फॉर एग्जांपल ब्लॉक से ब्लॉक से ये इधर से व्यू में जाएंगे ना व्यू में गया ड्रा नहीं नहीं ये इधर व्यू ये नीचे वाला जो व्यू है व्यू में यार अच्छा ये जो ट्रांसफार्मर है इसका स्केल हम चेंज कर देते हैं जस्ट स्केल एट स्केल एट फॉर एग्जाम्पल फिफ्टी ट्वेंटी फिफ्टी फिफ्टी इधर गया हो गया ये कटती हो गई अच्छा ये आ गया Now this block you want to change the color of this block for example. इस पे आप right click करेंगे, just right click and okay. edit block, block editor, control R, control R, or you can control A and then right click again, properties, and here is the color. By layer, by layer color. Yeah, by layer already there I think. नहीं नहीं ये black and white पे कर दिया, ये अब by layer हो गया बस ये. अब चेंज होगा अब जिस लेयर में आप करेंगे ना इसको सिंबल में की तरह सिंबल वाला आ जाएगा पहले फिक्स होता है अच्छा 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 ठीक है अब मैं क्लोज करता हूं इसको सेव चेंजेस और ये सिंबल वाला आ गया सिंबल अगर मैं इसको लेयर्स में जाता हूं फॉर एग्जांपल लेयर चेंज करेंगे तो कभी चेंज नहीं इफ आई विल चेंज यस जस्ट गुड नाइस ये दे दें और रोल नंबर क्या आपका 3 52 52 हां आंसर है यार ये सो ले रहे हैं इसको की जरूरत Okay now ये हो गया हमारा इसके बाद नेक्स्ट है सिटी सिटी द सेम सिटी विल रिपीट इट फॉर एग्जांपल आई विल कॉपी दिस सिटी आई 
I will copy the city and I will place it copy. And this is the base point, for example, and I will place it here. So city is also placed. So this distance between city is smaller, so I will just uh, delete one line, for example, here. And I will move this from here to here. So now there is a bus bar, 400 volt bus bar. So I will copy the same bus bar, this bus bar, and I will modify, copy, and I will place this bus bar here. Now I will extend this bus bar, for example, I will like this. And uh, if I want uh, the same length, so if I need the same length, then I will just uh, copy this one. Copy this one and from this point, I will move it here. So length will be same. This array ka jo na, array ka mara color change ho, blocks se ho gaya hai. Block graph, if you library set hathe hai, uska color change kaise karna hai, I have repeat, wo mene aapko guide kar diya, I have guide. But array ka color abhi tak change ni ho hai, agar kisi se ka hua, mujhe bata jiega hai. अरे अगर हमने एक तो सोल्यूशन मैंने बताया कि शुरू में जस्ट लेयर एक्टिवेट वही लेयर एक्टिवेट करें जिस तरह सिंबल लेयर है सिंबल लेयर एक्टिवेट करेंगे उसमें फिर आप अरे की कमांड से जो भी काम करेंगे तो वो उसी कलर में बनेगा लेकिन अगर गलती से दूसरी में बना लिया है तो बाकी तो शिफ्ट हो जाते हैं उस लेयर में आपने देखा है आपने किसी भी सिंबल को आप शिफ्ट कर लें उस लेयर में उसको सेलेक्ट करें और लेयर को सेलेक्ट करें दैट विल भी शिफ्टेड टू दैट बट अरेज में ये नहीं हो रहा अभी if you have the solution, just share it. Otherwise, I will share later. Later on. Okay. Hello. Now you can see the city and main circuit breaker. Breaker city same. Same repetition. You can see this repetition, 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 repetition. Two, two towards right and two towards left. So we will just copy it. You can see it. We will select this one. Select this line, this line, and we will copy it. Just copy, select this base point, and how much distance? You can specify the distance. For example, I will specify this, for example, 50 units. 50 units, 50 units is less, control Z. 100, ortho should be on. 100 units, yeah, 100 units, then 200 units. Yes, no is okay. So here, 100 units, 200 units. No placed, okay. But here you can see the distance uh, between these two are smaller. So control Z. Again, I will repeat the same process. Maybe select this one, this one. Modify, copy. They, this one is 100 units. For example, 150 units. 150. Yes, and then uh, 150 plus 100. 250. Yeah, no, it's okay. I think so. Maybe uh, not 250, maybe 150 plus uh, 50 only, 200, 200. Yeah, no, it's okay. In this side, 150, then 200. No, I think so. More realistic according to this figure. No, this is consumer. Consumer means houses. No, this 400 volt. Three phase, 400 volt or single phase, 220 volt or 230 volt. Now it will be connected to different houses or you can say consumers. So this is the arrow, arrow and that's consumer and here the same. So now I will just. Uh, here I need the line first. Draw the line here. For example, equal distance line if you want to draw. For example, I will have the units, for example, 40, 40 unit line. OK, and this line should be in the layers of lines. So I will just select the layer first lines layer. OK, now I need the arrow. So for arrow. Just you can see here if you want to draw the arrow, just take the line command and then ortho should be off. And this is the end point and place it here like this. Any angle, any angle ortho should be off. Just place it here, for example, here and select this. For example, this is the four units, four units. Okay, now, okay. 
escape no mirror it mirror it if you want to mirror it just copy mirror select this one enter and mirror it okay and you can connect this one also connect this one okay and the between you can say the line between you can say the line inside the arrow we don't need so trim command use the trim command right click and left click so you see arrow is ready so now we also want to fill this arrow okay so fill this arrow with the black color for example or any color so you can also create the layer hatch layer hatch layer for example h a t c h hatch hatches and you can color it for example for example red color so if you want to hatch it just go to draw the hatch hatch line uh, hatch layer activated now go to draw and hatch and in hatch you can only solid solid hatch just select the hatch type solid not pattern and just select this pick point and then select this one and close so you see the layer color hatch color was red so it is filled with red now the same process i will repeat with this line so i have to extend this line first so first i will activate the line layer and line command and i will for ortho should be on now so for example 30 units above okay now the same process i will repeat for example line layer i need this one and this one okay now i will just copy this one copy this arrow and i will copy this and base point is this one i will move it here this is done now the same repetition i want to perform here so i can use the mirror command <laughs> i can use the mirror command yes mirror you see mirror center point should be this one so you see enter so with the help of mirror command exactly placed in this way now we want to use the text well the remaining i think so ready everything is ready now we'll activate the text layer text layer text layer and we'll write we'll start writing 11 kb line or 11 kb bus bar so text layer in the text multi line text just select here <coughs> 11 kb bus bar or line huh? bus bar now select this Control A or just select hold the text and just change the size. This size by default size is 0 0.2. So you will select it. For example, you will say it is five units, five units. Press enter and close this text editor. You see. Still text is not uh, you say I want to change it to 10 times. For example, double click Control A this one 10 times, 10 times. Press enter close. Now I think so is okay. Now I want to convert it into single line. So this arrow, this arrow, move this arrow towards right. Now it is in single line. So now you can move this text from this box. You can move it anywhere. For example, here I want to place it. Okay. This is the text. Now I will copy this one and I will paste it here. This is my 400 bus bar, 400 volt, 400 volt bus bar. Okay. Close this one. Now the remaining I will copy paste this text and I will. For example, geo switch. This is geo switch. So I will copy this text control C and V. And this is geo switch, but this this size I will change a little bit. Smaller so 10 not 10 units. I will say five units because this is the. Five units, so I will move this. For the Now the next one is cable box. 
So I will copy again control C V and I will say this is the cable box. Double click control A cable box. Cable box. Close this one. You can move it a little here, for example, here. So copy, copy this one and paste it here. Double click control A. This is the underground. Underground cable, underground. Underground cable. Close this one, okay? Now, this is the cable box. So again, you can copy. No need to copy, otherwise, you can also copy this control C and V and just place it here. This is also the cable box. Now, the next one is. Next one is 11 KV OCB. 11 KB of CB oil circuit breaker. So control C V and place it here and double click 11 KV oil circuit breaker. Then 50 ratio 5 CT. So 50 ratio 5 CT control C V. For example, I will place it here. Trim करेंगे. Ratio five. और spacing दे लें. Spacing देंगे. आगे आखर में जाके CT लिख रहे हैं. CT. इससे काम चलेगा कि नहीं? हाँ, चल जाएगा. इस तरह ठीक है. उसके बाद हमने one MBA का transformer है. So I will write it. One MBA. Transformer. So, for example, copy this one and place it here. Double click Control A, one MBA. Now copy this Control C V and place it here. For example, or you can write here the same. For example, eleven KV four hundred volt. You can also write here. For example. Enter 11 KV slash 11 KV slash 400 volt. And you can move it a little here. And you can also write transformer. This is actually transformer. Transformer. Main OCB, main OCB, and then 12 ratio 5. Main OCB. So just copy OCB and place it here. And you can say it is main. Then twelve hundred ratio five. If you can see. It is. not taking the steps. You can switch off ortho. Now you can move it like, like that. So this one is. 1200 ratio 5. 1200 ratio 5. CT. This is done now. 400 volt OCB and. This is 400 volt OCB and CT is 200 ratio 5. So this CT is 200 ratio 5. Okay. Ortho can be off if it is not moving properly, so you can. Switch off ortho again on. 
this is a no. Uh, the same 400 OCB is there. You can copy it. Copy this. And paste it and remaining OCB if you have the. If you have the details, you can write it otherwise is OK. Now to the consumers. So to consumers, I want to write the text to consumers. So maybe their text. We can place it like this. So to consumers. And the same you can copy it here. Our drawing is ready. Who have done this one? now you can go to layer layout layout here is the layouts okay so in this layout just delete this one just select this window and de delete this for example you want to adjust it right now the window is this one so i want to adjust it so just delete this one and again go to layout layout here is the option of layout and here is the option of rectangular just click this rectangular and then you can say assign the area the dotted lines i want to assign this I want to place my drawing within this dotted line, so I will assign the area this one. You see now drawing is placed successfully. Now you can say with the ba white background color. Maybe maybe text is not visible much visible, so maybe text color I will change. For example, I will go to model and text color. Maybe I will change to. Uh, blue. For example, control S and layout. Now you see. The blue color is more visible and the yellow color also not visible. So in the model. Maybe yellow color I, I'll change to. I will change to. Purple magenta. Control S. Now you see magenta color is more visible. Any color I think so is OK. Otherwise cyan color also not visible cyan cyan. So cyan color maybe. Uh, Symbols color. I have to change it to. Red is done. No red red. For example, red. OK. Red. S. So for example, this one. So in this way you can see. The color is changed. So now go to control P or just uh, you can see in the layout there is the option of page setup or control P. Here you will add the setup, for example, setup one to PDF. ISO expanded A3, okay? And then apply to layout, okay? And now save it. Save the file. Save the PDF, for example. Labs, engineering drawing 10. For example, save it. Now the PDF is open, but you will see that the PDF is not uh, in the middle. So again, repeat the same process. Delete this one. Okay, and uh, rectangular. Designate the display area. This one. Wait. 
yes replace this one now you see this is in the middle so now it's ready now you need the black and white black and white for example control p and here is the right top option right top window monochrome monochrome just monochrome and apply layout and click okay and now save it black and white b and w for example black and white and save it you see now black and white color is also print print is ready black and white print is also ready okay so in this way you can print both colors now our drawing is ready so today is the end of session okay